Good to have you with me today for a little bit of time in the Word of God. And today I'm sharing with you from the prophet Isaiah. This is chapter 54, verse 10, which reads as follows. For the mountains may depart and the hills be removed, but my steadfast love shall not depart from you, and my covenant of peace shall not be removed, says the Lord, who has compassion on you. Let's notice what it is that God is saying to us in that verse. He's describing how even when a person's life, even then when the world, it may seem, is falling down around you, that God is one who is still faithful to be with you in every situation. Notice a couple of adjectives uh, and nouns that he makes use of here. One would be steadfast love. Another would be covenant of peace. And he's saying that even when the world doesn't hold together, even then I will be there to hold you together. That idea of steadfast love means it's not a come and go kind of love. It's not a here today, gone tomorrow sort of love, but it's a faithful love, one that continues. We could say the same thing in regard to the peace that is mentioned here, that it's a covenant of peace. When God makes a covenant, it's a solemn promise, one that he will not break ever. I think these are words that are particularly helpful for us because in our world and perhaps even in our communities and maybe in our lives, it may it may seem as though things are falling apart. There is uncertainty, there is fear. And in the midst of all of that, we see that we have a God who is steady as can be, who is faithful, who will not stop loving us, who will keep all of his promises to us. What does that do? That gives us a great amount of insur assurance. It gives us peace. It gives us joy and comfort because in our God, we are not dealing with someone who is unreliable, but one who is completely and totally faithful to do everything that he says. This gives us some wonderful assurance and peace to live each day, even this day. So no matter what may be going on, remember who the Lord is today in the midst of all of it, that he is with you and that he is not discouraged by what is taking place. In fact, he is actually entirely in control. We can trust him. Let's pray. Thank you, Lord, for your steadfast love. Thank you for your covenant of peace that you have with us, your children. We thank you, Lord, that in Jesus, your son, we have access to these tremendous gifts from you, that you are faithful to do everything that you promise. And so no matter what may be going on in our lives, Lord, help us to fix our eyes on you and to put our full confidence in you. You are faithful, and we praise and thank you for that. In Jesus' name. Amen. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day.